what system is right for me. When you go to the website, you'll see there's two primary systems. One is standard and one is adaptive contrast. The standard system was our original design. And through that design, we learned a lot. We learned a lot about progressive progression and training and training with people over longer periods of time, which caused us to kind of make some changes and move towards the adaptive contrast system as our preferred uh, method of training. And in these next couple of slides, we'll kind of go over the differences between these two systems and to see if you can, you know, use just a standard system in your situation or if you'd be better suited for an adaptive contrast system. LIVO2 standard is our original system. We produce the highest quality reservoir system on the market, period. And it's been consciously designed to be low in VOCs for chemically sensitive users. We've now been developing the LIVO2 standard system for well over seven plus years. And we've learned a lot over the years. We have a lot of experience and we've made incremental improvements every single year to get to, to the point where we are now, which is an extremely durable product that's gonna give you years of you know, quality service and do exactly what you need every single time. Uh, one of the best benefits of the standard system is it is easy to use. This system is extremely simple. All you do is charge the reservoir up, put the mask on and start exercising. The, the protocols are very simple because there is no switching that you have to do between high altitude and full oxygen. So it's a very simple system which can be beneficial for some users. You are gonna get really great results in the short term, which is good, but the only problem is that they may tend to plateau as your body starts getting used to breathing all this oxygen uh, all the time, and there is no way to really change or increase the resistance with the standard system. Uh, there are some challenges with the standard system. Number one is gonna be, like I mentioned, limited adjustability. Your body can get used to breathing this high percentage of oxygen all the time, and you'll get great results at the beginning, but then at a certain point, your body's gonna kind of get used to it. And as you can still get highly oxygenated, you won't see those longer term gains that you can see with the adaptive contrast system. Uh, and that leads into the results tend to plateau. And sometimes you actually might find it difficult to get your heart rate into those higher ranges on interval training with the standard system. Again, because you're breathing four times the amount of oxygen is normal. So uh, you kind of feel like Superman or Superwoman when you're training. Uh, which is excellent, but at the same time, it's not that good if we're trying to spike your heart rate up to get as much diffused oxygen into your blood plasma as we can. And again, you're gonna have limited choices of protocols because it's pretty simple. So the protocols are going to be pretty basic. Uh, basic hit interval training um, is going to be pretty much the protocol for the standard system. Uh, so the next option for systems would be the adaptive contrast. And like I said, all the, these issues that you would have with the standard system, um, we've been able to work out of those with adaptive contrast. And that takes us into standard versus adaptive contrast. Um, this is a good visual representation of what I think of when I think of how the two systems work. One, dumbbell, very simple. Uh, one resistance, it'll be hard at first until your body gets used to that and then it could potentially taper off. Adaptive contrast is like having every single weight in the whole entire gym uh, because you can constantly increase the difficulty of your protocol incrementally so that you know even someone who is you know, again, elderly in their 70s just looking for general health all the way to the most elite athletes in the world can use the same exact system and get the result that they need because it has complete adjustability. LIVO2 adaptive contrast. This is our flagship system. This is a system that has the high altitude contrast feature. This is, has all of the same uh, functionality as the standard system, but then a lot more versatility when we add in the adaptive contrast feature. Uh, it can be ran as a standard system alone if you're deconditioned and just starting out. Uh, and then when you're ready, you can flip on and start using the adaptive contrast features. We found that by short periods of hypoxic training. So putting you at high altitude for a short period of time, anywhere between 15 seconds to 30 seconds is the average. We actually cause a desaturation in your body. 
all of your physiology starts gearing towards trying to absorb as much oxygen as it possibly can because it doesn't have enough. And right when the body is craving oxygen uh, the most and your eyes are getting a little big and it gets slightly challenging, we've caused that physiological change that we're looking for. Right at that point, we'll flip the switch and put you back on pure O2 and give you a recovery on oxygen. We will switch back and forth between the high altitude and oxygen several times within a 15 minute session, depending on your protocol. Um, but that's kind of in a nutshell how we, how we operate an adaptive contrast training session. Again, this is the highest quality adaptive training system on the planet. There isn't a better one out there. And again, the same low VOC reservoir design, internal inspection zipper. This system gives excellent short-term results and great long-term results because if you start getting used to it, we can just adjust your protocol slightly, possibly extend the length of time you're at altitude or do a slight decrease in the amount of recovery time between intervals and it'll always get a fresh workout and it'll always feel new and challenging um, for years uh, from using the same type of system. And again, infinite adjustability and protocol parameters. Uh, there's a lot of ways to adjust the protocols and we guide you through that with the training that we provide over the phone uh, after you purchase the system where we can have the same system can train someone who's you know very elderly and just re recovering from some type of uh, injury or surgery or event all the way to high-end athletes everyone can get exactly what they need out of the system because of the adjustability here's a quick guide to fill times for the systems. This can be slightly confusing. We get a lot of questions about it. So with a 10 liter per minute concentrator, it's gonna take about one hour to fill up that reservoir bag. Um, if you're going between sessions, it can be as little as 45 minutes because there may be a little bit of oxygen left over. But if you're going from completely empty, you're looking at about a one hour fill time for a 10 liter per minute concentrator. Um, if that's too long for you to wait, you can we can send a second concentrator and a connector kit and that time to refill your reservoir bag can drop to 30 minutes. This isn't necessarily that critical if you're only training once a day at home, but if you're a practitioner looking to implement this into your practice, a 20 liter per minute system uh, might be a much better option than a 10 liter per minute. We also have a dual user system uh, which we're not really going to review in this uh, presentation guide, but that system can do up to four people in one hour, and it's a larger reservoir bag, and that's a great new system that we developed just for the practice. Let's get you on the road to better health today. I'm thankful to work with a team of passionate professionals whose hearts really are in the right place. Any one of our team members would be a great fit to help you through your process. They're all excellent, and I'm really uh, lucky to be working with a team of such professional and well-educated people on the subject of healing your body with oxygen. Please give us a call today and we'd be happy to walk you through the process and get you set up with the system and the training that'll perfectly fit your needs. I hope to hear from you soon and thank you for listening. Have a wonderful day.